guys, so I thought I'd try a little new series about helping beginner witches, people who aren't quite sure how to begin, have some small videos of helpful hints, tips, thoughts and ideas. And the first one I thought of was this really cute idea that I was just sitting with this morning. Now it is part of a larger altar piece around here and I have the beautiful Brigitte statue from my friend uh, sat here giving it some weight but really I just wanted to focus on this little beauty right here but the lighting looks better over here so I'm going to leave it over there and it was just a cute quick idea I had for witchlings who need a small transferable little altar piece that they can get out and change quite regularly so if they're not out of the witch closet yet or if they need to just put things away they haven't got much space that sort of thing so I came up with this cool little idea and it was just one of these gorgeous little orb stands which you can get from Wish and they're not exp very expensive at all uh, along with a rosebud some crystal chips and three pieces of rosemary and I decided on three for Maiden Mother Crone or Life, Death and Rebirth, however you see it, but three is a very mystical, magical number in the Celtic tradition and it's fairly easy to get hold of crystal chips of this variety, this size, quite cheaply, inexpensively and I decided to go for a green-white mixture, feeling quite spring-like as the spring is definitely in the air in the UK with a beautiful little rosebud pink there in the center. Now the crystals, if you're wondering, are mostly aventurine and quartz. Uh, there's a little bit of milky quartz in there, some clear quartz and uh, the aventurine. And these are all good energies for spring. So they're very cleansing, refreshing, renewing, balancing, healing. And that's what this little mini altar is. It's very motivated towards bringing in the energies of spring and having some healing done. And the little rosebud. Now roses, obviously, for most people, they're going to represent love. But for me here, it's that promise of a new beginning. So I felt very strongly about sharing this with you. It's really easy, really simple to do. And the great thing about this is that you can just have whatever you want in one of these little altar dishes. You can change it with the seasons. You can change it bi-monthly. You can change it with the moon phases. You could do whatever you like with it. Um, and it's really simple and easy to do. And you can get bags of crystal chips like this one really quickly and easily, really simple, really inexpensive, and then you can play with the colours a little bit. So I, where did I get my, oh, so these crystal gemstones were from growyourideas.co.uk, so growyourideas.co.uk, and um, yeah, so I just thought that was fun and simple and light and something that might be helpful for little witchlings if they're thinking you know I'd really love a pretty little focal point for my altar because this doesn't have to be your entire altar if you're okay with a bigger space it makes a really lovely centerpiece or something that you can place um, items to imbue over the top of if you, even if you like so there yeah, there you go I hope you enjoyed this video everybody I'm going to pop this on Instagram I'm going to pop it on YouTube later and many blessings <laughs>